Hey guys, welcome back to the Barge Tale. We're here in the Guild of Adventurers. Um, I have uh, killed a few enemies between episodes just so I can level up. Uh, we're up to 8,000 experience now, so we should be able to level up to level 5. I also wanted to go to the, um, uh, the equipment store, to Garth's equipment shop. And uh, I keep forgetting to give these guys proper equipment. Um, so let's see what else we can give them. I think they need some gauntlets. Um, I think we can use the tower shields as well. Uh, let's just have a look. So we've got the... I think we've got the plate armor or the scale. No, Craig can't wear plate. So I think he's got the scale. Yeah, that's what's... Equipped. Glasses warrior. He can use the plate. I had this before and I couldn't equip it. Um, we need the helm for him. Okay. AC is now four. Tower shield. Has that been equipped? Okay. Uh, Kian, let's have a look and see what we can do for him. Armor class three. He's the uh, hunter. We must have the health, uh, the plate armor already. Let's go with the helm. Gauntlets. Okay, armor class is down to one. Offhand items, tower shield. Okay, negative one AC, which is brilliant. Let's buy some more arrows. There we go. Um. I mean, I could give them longbows as well, but I don't think I will bother. Maybe Tegan I can give him a longbow. Um, may actually do more damage than the the broadsword. Alright, apparently he's not wearing scale. He is now. In the helm. Leather gloves, okay, it's down to five. Hmm. Let's give him the longbow and a few arrows there as well. Uh, maybe that's a bit too many because we are limited to how much stuff we can take. Um, LLL, let's have a look. We're going to give her a couple of torches. Um, and also, what weapon is she using at the moment? Let's give her leather armor. Helm, leather gloves. Is she wearing that already? I'm not sure. Uh, she should have that equipped. Uh, let's see if there's any, anything else for, uh, for Elin here. I think I've given him the robes already. Uh, I will check them all in a minute. Uh, leather gloves. Let's purchase that. Fuzzbit. Torch robes he should have. Leather gloves should be fine. Okay, that's pretty much it. So let's get out of here. Let's sell the stuff that I'm not using. Um, dagger and stuff. This war axe does a lot of damage. I did want to try that out. Uh, maybe I bought too many arrows. Ah, there we go. Chainmail I'm not using. Um, let's just uh, view the inventory first. Um, so Fuzzbit. Okay, he's got the leather gloves. Alright, so I can sell those. Um, helm, gloves. LLL's got the leather armor. Can she wear anything else? Can uh, Tegan wear the scale? Ah, oh, you can. Okay. Uh, let's give Tegan the scale. Tower shield. 
Okay, that helps quite a bit. Actually, that's going to give Tegan the bow and arrow. I think the tower shield is better for now. keen has got the tower shield already. Helm, gauntlets, okay. Nothing else for him. Uh, and Crag. Why is he not wearing plate armor? For some reason, I thought he couldn't uh, wear it before. Uh, okay, down to 2 AC. This is much better. So he's got the gauntlets, the helm, the buckler. I could give him the tower shield instead. Down to 1 AC. Okay, so this should make my characters a lot tougher in battle. Uh, so that's good. Let's go and sell all the stuff that we don't need. Uh, Buckler helm. I'll keep a longbow in case I want to give it to Tegan. I wonder if these uh, war axes are reusable. I get the feeling they're not. They do do a lot of damage though. I might keep one just to try it out. Okay. So I think that's all I need. We're going to head on out of here, go to the review board. Um, I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Just here. Okay, uh, advancement for. Well, let me get out of here first or a quick save. Um, let's go advancement. I do want to make sure we get some good hit points. 15, I guess, is fine. Plus one constitution, that's good as well. Um, Kian, plus 17 hit points. Nice. Tegan, plus 11 hit points. Alalil, plus 3 hit points. I guess that will have to do. Uh, Elin plus six spell points, that's nice to have. And uh, Fuzzbit plus four spell points, plus four HP, plus one strength. Uh, so that's good. Um, can anyone acquire spells? I don't think so. We need to wait one more level. Okay, let's just pop into here and quickly save the game. Uh, enter the city and then we will go to the, uh, the sewers again, I believe. Uh, that's where we're headed to next. Let's our, our first dungeon. Go through here. Tegan can order some a beer, first of all. Uh, now let's order a, a wine. Uh, so that should be fine. Someone should have a torch that they can use. Let's just use up one of these torches so we can have a look around. Um, I'm not going to bother uh, fighting the enemies here on this level. We will go straight down. Uh, stairs going down. Let's just go quickly so we can get down into the sewers. Explore a little bit further. They're not where we've been before. Uh-oh. Wow, that's quite, that's quite a few. We can't run. Fine. Okay, four magicians, five. Oh, they're all quite far away, aren't they? Um, okay, the dwarves will probably advance. Oh, the mad dogs will as well. Um, so let's just attack here. Another little ranged attack. Okay, those spells should do a decent amount of damage. 
There go the magicians. And there go the dwarves. Just the two mad dogs. Okay. Poison needle, 93% chance. Let's take it. Success. 223 experience and an unidentified arrow. Hopefully it's something good. Heading on down, yes. Right, so let's check out the first level of the sewers. I guess I can explore this area here. There's a few dark patches, uh, which I really don't like. Which way are we facing? Let's go this way. Take a look around. Okay, let's trap zap this. Nice, nice bits of experience there. Um, Tegan, I want to um, see if you can play a song. Kilnfest for the extra healing during battle. So I'll explore this area first. I do really wish I had a compass. Make this a bit easier. Ouch. Seven spiders. Okay, we do need a spell for this. Uh, let's go with War Strike. Uh, I think this should be fine. Okay, didn't get as much experience as I would have liked. I mean, that was. I think seven spiders. Three orcs. Two jade monks. I'm gonna run away if I can here. Just while I'm continuing to explore all of this. Seven half orcs. Could be quite a bit of experience. So let's attack them. Uh, when they're in a big group like this, I can use one of the magic caster's spells like Star Flare. And hopefully just wipe them all out. like they're all getting their attacks first. Alright. 298 experience. Oh, we're close now to level 7. Uh, so it's definitely very good. Made it all the way over here. We will just keep having a look around. Four conjurers. I will start uh, trying to run away now, I think. Just 
just so I can get this explored. Oh no. I, this is one I'd rather run away, run away from. Um, swordsmen, skeletons. I could defend and try to run away next turn. Okay, definitely casting a spell here. Let's, let's try to um, blind the the jade monks. Uh, let's cast holy water. Could cast that on the skeletons. I think mage gauntlets on Tegan. Be a big battle. Oh god. Did we kill anyone? Cast quick fix on uh, Alalil. All right, still the three skeletons. Is that it? Um, it's the sum. 396 experience. We've got some levels up here with Elin and Silver Star. Okay. What happened to the light? I think it just. I don't think. Well, are we in darkness? Um, I guess I can find out with a spell, can't I? Okay, we are in darkness. That's a shame. Okay, there is a path down here. Oh, I really don't like this pitch blackness. Here, so I can go. Oh, I can't go forwards. You have to bump into a wall to realize it's actually blocked. Okay, so that's all darkness there. Good. All right, so I'm out. I should be able to cast a link and fuzzbit cast something. Okay, it's all darkness in there, so that's not good. Did I get... Oh, we got teleported, okay. Teleport source, teleport destination, okay. That's interesting. and a nomad they're not gonna let us get away I 
actually. Arc Fire is a um, close range spell. Uh, let's do that, see how we do. I'm running out of spell points as well. Okay. Now any experience. So through here, how am I doing? Ah, uh, we explored quite a bit of the uh, first level of the sewers, I'd have to say. Um, facing away, okay, so I am facing up to the north. Uh, five spiders. in here, isn't it? Oh, we can't run away either. Okay, I'm doing okay for health. I'm just running low on magic points. Okay, I think that's everyone, so... Trap Zap. A Mithril Sword. Let's have a look at that. Okay, damage 4 to 10. Kian's using the... Um, Kian is using the Halberd 1 to 16, which is probably better, but can Tegan use it? Tegan can use it, can Alalel use it? Alalel can use it. Tegan's got the broadsword, Alalel has just the short sword, so let's give her the mithril sword. So she can do a little bit more damage in uh, close combat. 4 to 10, plus 2 to hit, that's nice. That is very, very nice. Do it, but I'm going to do a quick save here. Um, let's see if we can get out of here. So the stairs are over there. Getting out is going to be interesting. Ah, four sorcerers, four swordsmen. Interesting that you need to disarm the chest to get the experience. Um, I wonder if I can loop back around this way. Ah! Wait a minute, just let me figure out where I am. Okay, I am over here now. Hopefully this leads back to the stairs. Yes, it does. Yeah? Yes. Okay, good. Oof. Uh-oh. There is a combat. Can't run away from it. in this direction. I'm kind of figuring out the uh, layout of these areas. The old wine cellar. Uh, let's head on up. Beautiful. So we got some experience, which is good. Um, we are going to exit the tavern here. Looks like it is starting to get a little bit dark. How far away are they from uh, leveling up to level 7? They're very, very close. So let's go to the, uh, the north. I uh, want to head into the temple, heal the entire party. Probably the most important thing is getting the 
our spell points back, but we will get them back. Actually, that's the wrong way. We're going to go to the north here. We'll get the spell points back slowly over time, although it is dark, and I don't think we regenerate spell points during the night, but we will during the day. So, what I might do, I'm... I feel like I've had a bit of enough of a run around in the, uh, the sewers for now. Let's actually go to the review board. No, let's not go to the review board just yet. Because I want to get my uh, spill points back, but also... Where's Roscoe's? Not here. Um, yeah, I wanted the other characters to level up as well. Ah, oh, I missed Roscoe's somehow. Oh, there it is there. Okay, so there is a big uh, statue. Everyone has leveled up now. Brilliant. Um, I do want to identify an item. Let's recharge the mages. Um, identified it an item. I don't get it. How could they? How could they not know that that was a regular arrow? all regular arrows. How could how could they not identify that them, themselves? Hmm. Anyway. Going through the temple courtyard. This should lead around to the review board. Uh, quick save. Making sure we're going to get some health points. Uh, let's do the advancement first. Uh, I'm not very happy with that. So, now I'm going to try again. I'm actually going to try that again. I do want a little bit more than that for Crag. Plus 19 hit points. There seems to be a wide variation. T and Mac. Uh, Key and Mac, uh, Tegan, 16 HP is good. Alalil, plus 7 HP, I guess that will have to do. Elin, plus 3, plus 5, 1 intelligence, plus 2, plus 6, plus 1 dexterity. Okay, now we do get the spell advancement as well. Okay, Conjurer spells, Flesh Restore. Restores 10 to 40 hit points and cures poison and insanity. That's amazing. Instant Wolf. The spellcaster can make a real wolf appear and join the party fighting in its, def in its defense. Poison Strike. Poison Strike. Okay, Poison's a monster. Looks like it's just a single monster. Uh, let's pay for that now. 4,000 gold. It's getting a little bit more expensive. Uh, Fuzzbit. Dragon Breath. Okay, group damage, 11 to 44, nice. Spectre touch, single enemy, 16 to 60. And then, makes all stone and earth within range of the party glow with magical light, revealing even secret doors. Right, yes, let's pay for this. So, we should all be level 7 now, I believe. Uh, let's go and have a look. Level 7, next level is... 15,000. Um, we could try to take on some of the stone golems around the city. Um, I'm going to make my way down to the... Well, that's... Let's go to the temple area. Uh, and from there, head to the south, I think.
Now, we haven't explored this area before. Actually, I have. I've been in some of these houses. I'll further to the west. Spiders. We're on Emerald Street. Um, I could try to face one of the statues around here. See if we can defeat it. Four mercenaries. All right, let's see how we do against these mercenaries. Could cast um, instant wolf would be good. Uh, let's start off with war strike. Let's cast instant wolf. Dragon breath. I could try that as well. Let's try Mithril Might, see how see what that does to uh, AC. Okay, is that... I think the AC went down by three. Uh, so that's actually really good. I wonder how long that lasts. Uh, I should cast that out of combat, and it should last for longer. Okay, so... Go to uh, the magician. You throw might. How long does this last? Oh, it's only in combat. Okay. Can I? Single target, multi. Okay. So these are exploration. It doesn't actually say uh, the duration of the spell here. I guess that's something you need to look up. Or just figure out, but that's okay. Um, heading down here to the south. Another tower there, it seems. It's just randomly... Ah, the party finds a mace. Three skeletons. Let's just randomly enter a few uh, houses here. See what we can find. Hide in the shadows. Out of the shadows there and did a sneak attack. Okay, we're down to the south. Oh, there is a statue there. I might save and try to take that on. Come back out here. Um, casino. Ah, okay. Welcome, wealthy ones. Your gold, no credit given, is always good here. Let's play blackjack. Oh, we can actually... <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. That is very, very cool. What are we going to bet? Uh, five? Sure. Okay, so we need to get to 21 or five cards, I believe. Um, what's double down? Stand, hit... 
I don't know what double down is. Hit me. Alright, we busted. No good. Uh, Alright, let's put five. Deal. Uh, what's double down mean? Okay, we're right. I thought that ace was a one. I thought it could be a one or eleven. Um, okay, eleven. Hit me. Oh, we did get twenty-one. Okay, we won. We got uh, five gold back. Um, okay, that's fine. Let's 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 go go big or go home. There we go. We're going, we're going about five hundred. Uh, Thirteen. Hit me. Fifteen. Ooh. Hit me. No. Okay, we lost. No. I'm going to try that again. One, two, three, four, five. Let's deal. Uh, one more time. That's fourteen. Hit me. Let's see if we can get lucky. Fifteen. It's got to be uh, six or under. Hit me. Three. I'm going to stand. Hopefully we get lucky. It's a push. It's a draw. I can't leave it on a draw. One, two, three, four, five. Jack and a queen. All right, let's uh, let's stand. See what they get. Hopefully it's a bust. Oh what? They got very very lucky. Oh well, I'm done. I've lost a thousand gold already. Uh, more than that actually. Let's leave the table. Uh, we did not do very well there. But uh, if I'm feeling lucky, maybe I can go back and play a little bit more blackjack. Definitely do not feel lucky right at the moment. Um, Tegan is going to buy some uh, some mead. Uh, let's talk to the barkeep. Let's give him 100 gold. The stone golem has been spoken of twofold, the barkeep smiles. Uh, does that mean there's there's two of them? Uh, there's a temple here as well. Oh, the wolf's dead. I didn't even notice. Let's kick him from the party. I'm going to do a quick save. We're going to take on this statue. A statue of a stone giant stands guarding a gate. Attack it. We're going to fight bravely. Uh, let's try to hide in the shadows and do a critical hit. Uh, let's cast... They missed the next round of combat. Um, hmm. 6 to 24. The arc fire could possibly do a lot of damage. Fuzzbit is going to cast, I think, Wither. No, maybe not Wither Strike. I think. Uh, Spectre Touch. Good against single large creatures. Alright. Oh, we killed it already. I was expecting that to be much more difficult. Okay. Um, I don't suppose we can go through the gate, can we? Can go through the gate. Doing a quick save here. The home of Longinus the Mad. Let's talk to him. Summer follows winter, darkness follows day, singing follows sorrow as they stride through Scarabray. The home of. Twice will the Lestrade come for Kaith, once for gold, once for faith. Alright. Longinus the Mad. Longinus looks away and mumbles, Go then, if you were even here, for I was not. Okay. I feel like there's more to this area. But I'm sure I will discover that later on. And some robes. Ah, 
Ah, okay, another another stone giant. Let's take him out. The other one is very easy to, to kill. I don't even feel like I need to cast spells. Okay, job done. Um, so there's a little bit around here that we can explore. Guess I should go and do that. Ah, right, it is defended by something. Um, or is it? You stand before the city gates, which are blocked by a gigantic snowdrift. Okay. An ogre lord is guarding the gate. Let's cast our arc fire on the ogre lord and then once again cast a spectre touch. No! <laughs> Oh, that's it. Wow, okay. Fairly easy to deal with these creatures then. Uh, and we are through. More Ogre Lords. Another two Ogre Lords there. I guess they're good for experience. Hit for 41. <laughs> they do a lot of damage. Uh, Elin should have healing word. Well, that didn't do much. Fuzzbit has, uh, wait, there's a, a better healing, I think. Ah, Flesh Restore, 10 to 40, right. Nice. Take out this ogre as well. <laughs> Four points of damage, and he's been killed. That seems ridiculous. In an alleyway. Okay, heading through here and. Uh, Seeing what we can find. Well, a few different areas, actually. Hmm. You stand before an iron gate beyond which stands Mangar's Tower to the west. Okay, looks like we can't get through there at the moment. Uh, it's probably another way around, but I assume we can't get in this way as well. Yeah, there's Mangar's Tower there. Okay, so we can't get in there yet. Uh, but I think we have explored the whole city. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, it looks like it's pretty much all been explored. So that's really good. Just a couple of towers. We can't get to the castle here. Um, otherwise, we're just going to uh, head back to the Adventurer's Guild. Um, we're getting close to leveling up now to level 8. Um, so that will definitely be very good. I'll feel a little bit more confident going into the sewers uh, and later on into the catacombs. 
Um, I think I know my way back from here. Um, and uh, here, we, here we are back at the Adventurous Guild. So we'll leave it there. But uh, thanks for watching, and I'll uh, see you all again soon for more Bard's Tale.